Just text, I know it's a toss Oh, but I hate the fact that we lost such hey, The Uber pulling up on call Tell me as you're trying to fall through I'ma leave it up to you What you wanna do? Look, I'm trying to spend this time with you Know we all for do What you're doing right now, right now. Baby, won't you swing my way? It's been a day and I've been thinking out loud. I know I want you. Long time since the last time. Got a tab, we can run up. Knew you from the way, now we grown up. My look, yeah, made the realest ones nervous. But if you want it, clap it. I think that I know somewhere that we could go to crash it. We could keep the pace on slow, jam. Don't keep me on red. We go back where we first began No plans, all we have is the moment Just text, I know it's a toss I hate the fact that we lost touch The Uber pull it up, don't call Tell me as you try to We was raised a little different Used to be ashamed who I was Now I'm paid by the sentence Taking my time with it Baby, give me hey, you guys. So let's do this wig by Tanashi. I think that's how you say it by now. This is like the third time I work with them. But I'm going to be using these tinting sprays. The first one that I tried out was the Adore. I purchased this like a couple of years ago and I really don't use them much. But I'm going to try to spray that. And the color I think I used is the caramel. I'm not really sure. I have three different colors. There was like a batch, a bundle deal. And also this one right here, which is wig, wig extensions. This one I have actually purchased also in the color beige and golden. And girl, when I tell you that I really actually do like the wig extension ones the most, it seems like the formula is a lot more concentrated versus the Adore one. You know, let me know your thoughts on each brand, but I decided to go ahead and tint the lace. This is an undetectable Swiss transparent HD lace frontal by Tanashi, but the color seemed a little bit too light for my skin. So I said, let me just try this bleaching or this tinting. I've used these several times before in the past and I just kind of forgot about them and left them in my collection, but they do work perfectly well. You will need to blow dry it if you plan on wearing the unit right away. But the one that was my favorite is the wig, wig extensions. I think that's what it's called. I'll definitely link it below. You can purchase it from eBay, Amazon. Of course, the cans are smaller. And yes, I am re-watching The Walking Dead over again for who knows how many times. But if you guys are a Walking Dead fan and y'all seen the final season series finale, then girl, I'm going to just say this. Rosita is definitely a badass she is one badass and that entire series finale was nothing without her like she kicked ass and her comeback from being a walker attacked was amazing like epic and even though she died she surely like her scene was epic that's all i can tell you it was the best scene in the show now, as you guys see to the left, I am tweezing the hair with my tweezers just to make the hairline a lot more thinner. That way it looks a lot natural as possible. And for the most part, you guys, it was a super duper easy slay. This lace came out good. The only issue I had after I bleached it was some of the knots did not lift. That's okay. That's the reason why I kind of like wanted to see if it worked out in my favor with the tinting but the lace did tint and like i stated you will need to blow dry if you decide to use any tinting spray and look at the color it looks very close and it just it just looks really good so i mean i will link the products down below that i use but i'm also going to be using some of my pressed powder and just spraying it with the aussie instant freeze the aussie instant free aerosol con of half spray i absolutely love Love that hairspray if you guys know me well enough you do know that i've used it forever okay now on to the customization of this 13 by 4 16 inch brazilian body wave virgin lace frontal 
Now, as you see, it's over flapping my ears in some sections or over flapping my ear. So I'm just going to take my comb and I'm going to part it directly over my ear, as you see, and snip it off. Girl, I already told you guys like forever ago to save these pieces because now look, they are selling baby hair lace pieces, okay? Girl, you can still create your own by when you customize your wig, cut it off and save it, okay? I'm telling you, it's the same ass stuff, okay? Now on to the wig application. As you guys know me, I like to use the Aussie Instant Freeze in the aerosol kind. You can definitely get this in a pump spray. I really don't know how that one works because I've never used it. I always use the aerosol can and I get a three pack on Amazon. I think it's like now $14. You know, prices be rising, girl, but whatever. I'm gonna just do my wig like this, this method. Like I do see people do it like this. I've done it like this a couple times. But for me, I just feel like once you do it like this, then when you cut the lace off, girl, the, ends, the edges of the lace be jagged and then you still gotta go back and put more hairspray on. So once you see me cut the lace you will see that I'm going to have to tack the edges down I just feel like that's a little bit more work than needed okay in my opinion but you know to each his own if you like it I love it okay serious but as you guys see I'm just gonna go ahead and smooth the hair back as the hairspray dries now normally what I do is I allow the hairspray to get tacky Prior to applying the lace, the unit down, I will spray like three coats of hairspray. Between each coat, I will allow it to get tacky, and then I will spray the second coat on, allow it to get tacky, and the third. But we're gonna just do this method because some people swear by it, and I ain't knocking nobody's hustle or flow, baby. Not at all. You gotta do what's best for you. And girl, I like to do my way, but you know, sometimes you gotta switch it up because I don't want nobody getting bored with me. You know, you gotta do it like it's your B day, even if it ain't, girl. Okay? even if it ain't. So let me tell y'all about Tanashi. They got really inexpensive hair. Like I said, this is 16 inches, 150% density. Uh, let's see, it's a 13 by four and it is a Brazilian body weight. And it's an HD Swiss undetectable transparent lace. Cool. Try to say that quickly like five times to see how far you get. But so they have like really inexpensive units. If you're on a budget, that's great. If you ain't on a budget, that's even great too. Kudos for you. But I just feel like this. As long as you know how to finesse some shit, as long as you know how to finesse some lace and a wig, girl, you can get you any wig and make it look natural as possible. Now, this is the part where I was telling you about after you cut the lace off, then you still got to go back with some more hairspray and perfect the edges. So this is why I feel like the way that I do it, it's just fine. Cutting the lace off and then applying the wig down. Girl, I don't be needing to do no extra steps. I really want the wig to come out the box straight up, cut lace, pre-plucked, and just, it'll. I just wanted to put its own self on my head and do all the work. Like, I don't really want to do nothing, okay, when it comes to wigs too much. But, you know, sometimes we have to, and the less expensive they are, the little bit more work you have to do. Now, this lace did come out pretty decent, especially for the price, the affordability, like I said, this is like the third time for me working with Tanashi, and I will give them their props. They have some nice units, okay? Now, this part right here is optional, but I'm going to make me some sideburns and some baby hairs. you guys so now let's put this elastic headband on and take these clips out so that way we can style and profile even in the cheapest lace front okay 
and I think the color tinting came out okay. Like I said, I have plenty of colors. Wig Extensions offers an array of colors. I have beige, I have gold. Yes, you do see that Walking Dead? Yes, you see that on my chair. Beige and gold, and you know, sometimes you gotta mix them up. But I think the wig came out pretty decent for the price, you know what I'm saying? Especially for the lace. Girl, go get you one. Stop front. it's about to be Christmas. Happy holidays, treat yourself. You know what I'm saying? Make sure that you looking cute always. But take it from me, you really don't need a wig to look cute and beautiful because baby like they say i woke up like this we wake up every day looking beautiful regardless makeup hair outfit or whatever be your own beauty be your own beautiful and rock it wear it own it okay but I love you guys. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. I will leave all of the information down below for Tanashi hair. I think it came out decent, especially once I put that concealer in. And girl, I love that Ardell concealer that I got at the Dollar Tree Plus store, okay? And as for the curls, I think they came out awesome. Y'all know I don't be doing no middle parts, but I think she looks rather just rather nice. So I love you all. Stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs the video up. Happy holidays and bye bye.